In music, you see that uh, Timbaland's making an AI app or oh, plugin or something like that where you can access, he didn't say who, someone who has gone and passed and used their vocals he, for whatever he, he, he rolled that to biggie do. shit out. So I'm that, sure it's so maybe it's a biggie. week later I could roll out my app. Yeah. yeah. Can't be mad. I can't, I can't uh, be mad. That shit is nasty. It can't be mad, though. That shit is yes, nasty. Yes, you can. I know. But how a nigga get steak, you can't be mad. How a nigga get no money. Yeah, but that's true. That's true. You found the loophole. Because we mad about it. Yeah. <laughs> tell us what are you mad about we're, it about. We're, 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 we're acknowledging joke, the creativity. Joke, 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 this nigga's crazy. And the scam. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's what we mad. We're acknowledging the nigga that came up. That's what we're acknowledging. <laughs> Joe, we'll continue. Gotta, you gotta respect the jokes. Yeah, I don't want to hear none I mean, of that continue. shit. I'm not a fan Get of that. Arti- point I'm not a fan of it artistically, mm-hmm. right? I'm not a fan of because even the shit that he did with Big, I didn't like that shit. But I didn't know he had an app. You think coming. Biggie's daughter liked it? No, probably not. You think Biggie's mom liked it? Probably not. You think Biggie's daughter's future daughter will well, like we, it? We can't speak for that. Uh, we guess we can Because times has changed Times will change Keep coming in here Talking about estates and legacies Hold mm-hmm. on but times will change We have these talk That times ain't gonna change If do your music was a hit Then your lineage Should be able to Reap the benefits said, of You the said hit. last part uh, A part a while ago That sometimes when music play It doesn't Even though it's a hit It doesn't sonically sound good I'm saying that That don't, ma- that don't matter Hold on listen I'm saying that times has changed Meaning that if Biggie's daughter's daughter, by that time, they'll be accustomed to the whole AI thing and look forward to it. You can't use my dad's yeah, voice not and just my that. family now people, not be paid. People are starting to but trademark you voices. Different. Different. No, that's no, the not. only thing I'm oh, talking about. You're talking about, about payment-wise. Yes, no, 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 I don't people. care about what they do sonically and artistically. I got you, okay. It's wrong that you want to take all of the dead great artists' vocals Marvin Gaye family ain't having it. Nah, <laughs> no, not the gays. So you play if you want. I'm wondering. I'm saying everybody pretty soon is going to start trademarking their voice. Well, that's where they're pushing. That's where they're pushing. That's yes. what Guru, that, that was his response to tra- it. Like, trademark your actual voice. My bigger thing about well, the Timbaland Some people shit, have started already. My bigger thing about the Timbaland shit is he was mad when uh, Chris Brown and Drake and them were trying to use Aaliyah's vocals. Yeah, he was. So now how are you going to be mad? How are you going to be... Using someone else's unless it's Aaliyah, I don't know. It's it just feels wrong to me. So you feel like he's but you're not using. You feel like it's wrong. You it, feel like and it's corny, like fucking Young Guru said. Mm. Somebody find Young Guru statement. Uh, you feel you. like you have the right to use Aaliyah joint though. As you saying, Paul, you feel like that's the pass you'll give him if it was Aaliyah's vocals that he was manipulating. Well, I still wouldn't give it a pass mm-hmm. because he's mad about people not. I think his quote was something like, "Only his musical soulmate should be able to use her." Her musical soulmate should be able to use her vocals, meaning him and Missy. Missy, Missy and him. Got it. And so can't. now you're going to give this vocal to every Tom, Dick, and Harry in the world to rock with? And now you want to pull up all the dead artist vocals and let AI, you want to be the one to profit off of the AI using them? That, that makes sense to what y'all? Guru, no. Guru, said, Guru said, I love you, my brother. You know I do, but this ain't it. This is dangerous at a basic level, and it's corny. Just corny. On the sides of the Ludites. Here's the thing about AI that's really troubling is, yeah, it's able to accomplish a whole bunch of stuff that is outside the realm of, you know, human ability. But it's what it cannot manipulate is it cannot manipulate certain things like um, being sentimental. Yeah, how do I sentimentalism? There we go. Yeah, sentimentalism, okay. nostalgia. Uh-huh. Like these are human emotions that will never, ever be able to be mimicked by any kind of machine. And even though it. It's awful when we do lose an artist and we lose an artist like, you know, Biggie, Michael Jackson, Prince. There's about something it. about having their catalog and it ending where they ended that mm. is, it's like it's part of the soundtrack of our lives. So the manipulation of trying to create music in their voice, but it's not them. It's ugly. It's really it's, it's yucky. It feels, that echoes it feels Tyler, Tyler the Creator's too. point about posthumous Albums don't. He said, "Don't put no posthumous shit out." Absolutely. Same I, thing. And when I pop, stopped the art, he was like, "Yo, don't release any posthumous albums. Those were demos. Those were not meant to be heard by the public. If I wanted yeah. them out, I'd have put them out. Right. Don't release any of my and, posthumous and music. When somebody passes away, and like that, just adds to the value of they old shit. Right. Mm-hmm. If I could just keep creating shit that's not them in their voice, it takes away from. Now let me ask y'all a flip side to this. If an artist pass away and their estate. You trying to set this up for the kids, for like you said, the kids, kids, whatever, and they decide to say, hey, I want to use my dad's vocals to try to put something together to generate some money for 
us. It depends because every estate ain't owned by the family. I'm, I'm saying in, in my example, the family owns this. This oh, is do what their you want. decision. Do what you want. You could do it. Do what you yeah. want. Yeah. Okay. That's what I It's said. not Depends. Timberland doing it. Right. Okay. And listen, listen, and niggas be letting Timberland get shit off because we love Timberland. Timberland. Yeah. That whole B-Club shit, it, it, we got questions about that too. Which one was that? What is that? Where he got all of these producers from all over the world signing the contract, sending them shit, and now he highlights them on Instagram uh, and there's some paperwork involved. And now, like, it, we had questions. Mm-hmm. We got but, questions. But you I don't. You, Timberland, if an up-and-coming producer wants to follow your, then by all means, have at it. But... Isn't that what has been happening forever, though? Like, producers that be fire. The music business has been, been, has been corrupt forever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's not an excuse to me for hey. people to continue those business practices if that's what he's doing. Give me your fire beat. I put my name on it. We're going to sell it for this. Yeah. And because then if you sell it, you can't get that. You can't get that. But then I'm, I'm going to take, take 10. But I'm going to take you. But I'm going to take 10 of them, and I'm going to yeah. give you some bread that you would have never had. And then hopefully you can really start going around moving and Mm. Which is manipulative help. It is. Because now I'm going to go to the publishing the publishing uh, office and tell them all these slaps I made. Mm-hmm. And the publisher's going to say, no, you didn't. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And now what? Nothing. But now you, in marketing yourself, you can say, yo, I'm really, I really am the producer behind this, 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 too and late. this. Too if too I late. have to walk let in me, the office and late. say, I finish. start the sentence with, I really am something, let me then finish. this is over. Mm-hmm. But now when I go sell a beat to Parks, who's an up-and-coming artist, mm-hmm. I can say, yo, I really did those. When I go sell a beat to Ice, now I can say, I really did those. No, you can't. Don't I'm matter. telling you, it ain't going to work like that. Don't it's matter. not going to work. It don't even matter. You can say whatever you want when you go anywhere you want. If you can't prove it. Then Kanye right. do that. Do what? Do what? He was the ghost producer for Mad Niggas. He was. And he, now that he's up, or now when I'm moving around and I'm meeting the people, you can say, y'all really did that. Be- but he made some earthquakes himself, though. Yeah, different and, time and, and different, no, listen to different what I'm saying. Time place. And he's done the exact opposite, too. He's had, like, I got, I got the clip nah, where he's talking about the down and out beat that everybody attributes to him. Cam record. He didn't produce that. You know, never mind. Go ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm saying this. He did it? If no. I made a beat for Park. Brian uh-huh. Miller did that. And I sold it to Parks, uh-huh. right? Yeah, yeah. When I finally meet Parks, yeah. I can say, yo, yo, you know I was the nigga really behind such and such. And you're like, oh, word, I didn't know that. I bought it from Ice. Now I can now pitch to Parks and say, yo, I got some more shit if you want it. Okay, stop right there. You go to Parks and say, I'm really the person behind that Ice beat. Mm-hmm. Why he got to believe that? He don't. So, but realistically, Never mind, com- no. I'm, I'm, not try- I'm trying to have a conversation with what you. what I'm saying is, he don't have to believe me, but he can say, oh, word, I got some more beats. Do you mind if I send you some more beats? Mm-hmm. Park says no. Now I just killed the middleman business-wise. I killed the middleman. Hopefully Parks likes some of the beats that I sent him, and that's that. The more beats part is where the conversation lies. Yeah, that's you what I'm saying. don't care about the first that beat, other I, shit. I, I sold that already. I took shit. the short Do you have heat or, or not? not? Yeah. That's my point. New Joe Biden.